How to replace the thermal paste in a laptop. At the request of fans, today we're replacing the thermal paste on the Dell G15. 5520 2022. Tutorials for replacing and upgrading thermal paste on laptops are available in the main tutorial collection on our homepage. You can also comment with your model if you need specific guidance. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Step 1. Get tools ready. Many tools are needed to replace the laptop's thermal paste. Apart from the thermal paste and thermal paste cleaning wipes, some gadgets can help you to disassemble the laptop much more easily. If you don't want to buy them separately, you can find our total solution combo in our profile. Step 2. Remove the laptop case and battery. Before you start disassembling the computer, it's highly recommended to wash your hands or wear gloves or an anti-static wristband to eliminate static electricity. Place the laptop face down and use a PH1 screwdriver to remove all the screws on the bottom cover, six in total. Loosen the four captive screws. It's advised to use a magnetic mat to avoid mixing or losing screws. Prepare a triangular pry tool and a spudger. Insert a pry tool at the bottom, gently pry the edges to open the cover. and disconnect the power cable by pushing the clip outward using the spudger. Once disconnected, press and hold the power button for 15 seconds to discharge any residual power. Step 3. Remove the heatsink and old thermal paste. Remove the first screw securing the battery. Lift it gently and set it aside. Use a spudger to disconnect for ribbon cables and remove for screws. Carefully remove the side protective cover with the spudger. Disconnect the fan power cables on both sides and the audio power cable on the right. Remove the two screws securing the SSD and then remove it. Disconnect the wireless card by unscrewing one screw and gently lift the plastic cover to detach the wireless card. Peel off the adhesive tape and remove two additional ribbon cables and 11 screws, along with two small metal clips. Flip the motherboard over, then loosen the six screws on the heatsink in order. Use a high-quality screwdriver, such as the Cooling Monster Combo 01, and apply vertical pressure to prevent stripping the screws. Carefully lift the heatsink to remove it. To clean the old thermal paste more efficiently, we recommend using Cooling Monster Clean 01 Thermal Paste Cleaning Wipes. If you're worried about getting your hands dirty, you can use the disposable gloves included in our kit. Here you can see, the thermal paste on the processor has dried up after years of use, reducing its cooling efficiency. It needs timely replacement. 
Wipe off any residual paste on the heat sink. Step 4. Clean the fan. Remove the screws securing the fans, three on each side. Use an anti-static brush to clean the fan blades gently. Clean the back panel thoroughly as well. Step 5. Apply thermal paste. Here we used cooling Monster Cold 01 high performance thermal paste. Apply an appropriate amount of thermal paste on the surfaces of the CPU and GPU. After applying the thermal paste, you can use the spatula to evenly spread out the thermal paste and remove the excess. You can also use the P-size method if you like. Step 6. Reassemble your laptop. Reassemble the components in reverse order. Secure the fans with their respective screws. Reattach the heatsink and tighten the screws in numerical order until they are moderately tight, then tighten them fully to avoid uneven stress. Reconnect the motherboard carefully, ensuring no cables are pinched. Secure the 11 screws and the two small metal clips. Reconnect all ribbon cables, fan power cables, and the wireless card. Replace the SSD and secure it with two screws. Attach the side protective cover and secure it with four screws. Place the battery back, fasten it with four screws, and reconnect the power cable to the motherboard using the spudger. Close the back cover and fasten all the screws. Follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster and let us know which laptops to demo this process with next.